What is going on guys? DPG here in this video we are playing NBA Live 19. I've been playing this over the last few days because well I am well I haven't been in the country and as of right now I do not have one of the codes so um we're gonna get as much as we can out of the 10 hours and hopefully hopefully by the time uh, the 7th of September comes around we do get a code so we can keep playing uh the, well playing the game for this year anyway. We get a 69 overall waiters? What? Why is he so low? We got Mirza Teletovic, Marquise Teague. Teletovic is a free agent, really? Uh, ben Moore, Jalen Jones, uh, Yudonis Haslam, Andrew Har or Aaron Harrison. Um, wow, this team's awful. Why are they so low? Why are they so low? This is really weird. Okay. I don't understand why you got 60 overall Dion Waiters, but I'll take it, I guess. Now let's have a look at the market. Let's see what it's like. Let's see, is there any? Okay, I'm gonna go and do a pack opening first. See how much 2,200 gets me. I get number 15 NBA Live 19 packs for 17 euro. 40 packs for 5,500. I do not have that much, and I don't want to buy that much. At least you can finally buy it on the. Okay, so I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna buy 20 worth of packs. Okay, so we now got 2,200 points. Let's see what the marketplace is like, though. I say not the marketplace, the um, community market is like though. Okay, so let's see. Jersey, venue, and um, player. Item tier, gold. I'm sorry if my voice sounds a little bit weird. I've been out of the country last week and I'm just in bits like I'm not feeling great at all. Um, gold player, is this star price or buy now? These are all purchase prices. There's no bid prices by the looks of it. You have to go to two hour mark to kind of finish it off. Like, oh, there's a Mellow Nuggets card. Why is there a, me a Mellow Nuggets card with like a Timberwolves? Uh, or it's a rookie Mellow card, I guess. Um, Bob Cousy. It's kind of cool, all these different versions of cards, though. I think that's really, really cool. Um, so let's have a look, see if there's any elites. Oh, no, it's only brown, silver, gold. Okay, so um, let's open the 15 packs and see what happens. Um, all right, so let's go to store. I do not have like, is there a 19 pack one left? 40. 81 overall. So basically you open 12,000 which is like 100 and something and you get an 83 overall Al Depot. Yeah, no thanks with that one. But it's probably going to be the last, um, it's 110,000 coins worth. 2,100. And that's me down to 100. So we've got 16 packs to open. So um, let's... Okay, so this has 175 overall gold player. Plus three other players. So let's see who we can get in these packs. We should have a whole new team anyway. Wow, Damare, Carroll. Well, that was 13, 14. 13, 14? Really? Not 15, 16? When they were unreal? We got a Nick J. Or Smith, a James Ennis, and a Mario Chalmers. Alright, let's see who we can get. Hopefully, hopefully we can start getting good people. We get an Al Harrington from 2002, 2003. I don't know. That's great. He's got good speed. He's got a really well rounded player. So he should be actually okay. Ooh, Josh Smith might be kind of cool to use. His dunking, though, hopefully should be good. Tyreek Evans, 15-16, only 67. And D'Angelo Russell, sophomore card? It's just average at everything, which is kind of really weird. Um, but it's kind of cool. We've got the likes of Josh Smith and Al Harrington. These are new players that I don't think were in the game last year. I don't like how um, your inventory caps out of 500, though. Um, Mark Jackson, not a great card, to be completely honest. Um, we got Nick Stauskas because they can't shoot. We got a free agent, Joe Johnson. But not a great pack there. So let's see. It's like, there's no elite. So I don't think we can get anything great. Like, we got um, a really, really nice card uh, last year, I think. We got a... Ooh, 82 Sean Elliott. This card is really nice. We got a Trevor Reza from 2010, Jeff Green. But 82 Sean Elliott. Wow, this card is nice. 88 speed, 86 three-point. Great at good at everything else. This card is really, really nice. I will take it. I will gladly take that. Hey, the way the one bonus is literally like it needs 175 overall plus overall player. And I was like, well, I've gotten all 75 overall players in all of these packs. So that packs hope. Okay, we got a worse version of shot of what? Okay, we got a rookie J. This isn't a rookie. Why is it a picture of Pacers Jalen Rose and being like an old Jalen Rose? We got rookie Jalen Brown. We got Latrell Sprewell. 
And then we got a slightly worse version of Sean Elliott. So, um, I'm just going to send to my listings. I don't know what exactly he goes for. But, um, at least we've gotten a lot of different players, I guess. Um, not that happy with that pack, to be completely honest, though. So, let's see. Come on, give me something. We got a Kyle Lowry from the Rockets. We got a Zach Levine. How is current Zach Levine only a 69 overall? Hopefully, he's a good dunker, though. All right, like we really haven't gotten too much luck yet. We got nine more packs, but we did get the really good Sean Then we got the worst Sean straight afterwards. We got Jordan Clarkson. How is Jordan Clarkson rated higher than Zach Levine for this coming year? We've got a Channing Fry that can barely shoot. Like this, this game just doesn't make any sense. At least Tim Hardaway is in the picture of Reggie Bullock this year. But these ratings don't make any sense for Ultimate Team. Like they actually don't make sense. We got a Kent Bays more than 15 and 16. Who was 75 overall. Not a great pickup. We got Brandon Jennings from 14 and 15. It should be rated higher. He balled when he first went to Pistons. Um, MKG is okay, I guess. But like so far, I haven't played Ultimate Team. Hopefully, um, these cards perform better than the stats do anyway. And hopefully there's some good challenges to get better cards. This is probably going to be the last pack. I'm oh, we got Bill Russell. We got Bill Russell. Let's go. 84 overall, Bill Russell. That is insane. That is an absolutely insane, insane pull. We also get a dupe Tyreek Evans. So let's see if I can send him to my listings. But Bill Russell, 84 overall. That is unreal. And maybe the best, one of the best cards in the game you can get. We got 84 overall Bill Russell. I will take take it. I will take it. We got Bizzle Pete as well. Let's go. I know it's not the actual Bizzle Pete. We also got Shaquille O'Neal, George Gervin. I know again, it's old George Gervin, old Shaq. We got Shaq, Pete Maravich, and George Gervin in the last, like, pack. We've got CJ McCollum before his breakout year. So not in the last pack, in the last uh, two packs. But um, I'm happy with that. I will take it. Pete Maravich looks insane stats-wise as well. He's got a lot of things. Let's go. Let's keep a good pack look. We had horrible look at the start. Let's keep it good now. Patty Mills. Patty Mills. Oh, uh, it's DDY. Patty is DDY. And I know Americans spell it TTY, but that's just not. How to frustrate an Irish person? Spell Patty, spell Patty with a T. That is literally how you frustrate an Irish person. Ooh, we got Rick Smiths. You guys might think this is a big deal, but he's seven foot four. That's why it's a big deal. And uh, we also got uh, Josh McRoberts, who I didn't even know was. Oh, 2011, 2012. I was like, I didn't think he was still in the NBA. But, um, guys, IT as well. Rick Smiths is probably a better. Uh, pick up the night tea, to be completely honest though um oh we got Paul Pierce from the Nets that's kind of cool Tim Hardaway Jr. sophomore even though he made like the all rookie second team which I'm surprised he's rated that low but um Shabazz Muhammad isn't actually that bad a card to be completely honest um let's go we have got two more I'm actually gonna open this one before we open the other two hopefully this is an even better hopefully it's the best player we've gotten so far okay we got Bob Cousy one of the best players of all time. Well, not one of the best players of all time. One of the best players in of his era. And then we have got also Bill Russell. So Bob Cousy and Bill Russell at the same time should be quite good to use. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Two more packs. Two more packs. Devin Harris, 2010-2011. We got a Latrell Sprewell. Another Latrell Sprewell. We got a Jared Jeffries. 6'11", small forward. So he could be really nice. And Gary Payton II. So the same Latrell Sprewell from the Warriors for two different cards that neither of them are on the Warriors. Devin Harris, why couldn't we've got an 0809 Devin Harris when he was an All-Star? He won last pack. In our last pack last year, we pulled Isaiah Thomas. We pulled our only elite pull of, well, until Christmas was this pack last year. So let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, Ray Allen. I'll take it. I'll, I will take it. We got each one more as well, who's a beast. Current, or last season each one more we also got ryan anderson who can barely shoot but i will take the ray allen i will gladly take the ray allen but um yeah so this is the team we have we do have a bill russell card who is by far our well biggest name player p Meyer, which looks like a beast sean elliott's a beast and um let's see shaq with the celtics well, he doesn't really have much going for him to be completely honest but um it is still shaq and we do have a 7-4 rick smiths like not the worst team to be completely honest 
But anyway, that's the video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.